Hi, my name is Connor Hill. I play corner infield and pitcher at Tuscaloosa University. I'm a class of 2021, and this is a What's in My Bag video. So I, I carry around two bags, a backpack and a duffel bag, kind of just for like like shoes. The, this bag is really just for like shoes, towel, Gatorade, stuff like that. Uh, I have a um, some uh, Under Armour yard cleats. They're uh, freaking, I love them. They're awesome. They're comfortable. They're a little dirty right now. They were white at one point, but uh, I think they look a lot better dirty anyway. Uh, I got a Gatorade towel on the side because you never know hot days like this. We're sweating. You need to wipe it off. Sweat will get in your eyes. Just, this is just really a must need in the summertime. And then uh, in the second pocket, we have uh, kind of a bunch of stuff. We got uh, a little Thumb Pro baggie with just like eye black, some Tiger Bomb. You never know when you're going to need it and your arm's hurting. Uh, in that same pocket, we also have some um, Ball Players Bomb Game Ready Glove Conditioner. I love to using this whenever I play first. You put it in, uh, you put it on your glove, kind of like to condition it, but it also adds like a little bit of tack to it, so the ball sticks in it a little bit better. As far as I know, this is completely legal. Don't quote me on that. Uh, I also got a pocket radar. I love using these things for just like see where I'm at on exit velo, uh, arm strength pitching video, stuff like that. Just, you know, take notes of where I'm at, how I'm progressing. We also have seeds. You gotta have seeds. I got original, barbecue, and ranch. Ranch is personally my favorite, but you gotta have seeds if you're on a baseball field. Next, we got my belt. It's just a normal Under Armour belt. Always gotta have a belt in your bag. I normally carry two in case someone loses it, but pretty sure that one broke, so all I got is this one. We also got a baseball player's best friend, ibuprofen. If you don't have these in your bag and you're playing at the next level, you got to have them. They're just, it's a day in and day out grind. You got to have something to take off the pain. Next, we got uh, my backup pair of Oakleys. These are, oh, I got a couple. I think this is, yeah, these are my uh, Oakley Sutros. Love these. I think they're actually cycling glasses, but they're awesome. I got the Prism Road lenses. I don't use anything other than Oakley. They're the best for baseball. They just, they make everything a whole lot clearer. And then I also got these on my hat. And these are my babies. The Oakley Radars, the EV Paths, same thing, same lenses, all black. Love these. I normally don't put these in a case. I just keep them on a hat somewhere just so I always know where they're at. And uh, I think that's it in here. Now I got some batteries for pocket radar. Oh yeah, I got some. In this bottom pocket, I got a extra pair of turfs. These are actually like lacrosse shoes but I love them for like actual turf like if you're playing on like a turf field I really like these lacrosse cleats just because normal turfs they'll like they'll kind of slip a little bit more but these lacrosse cleats are like made for turf so I'll have these in my bag and that's it for this bag next is uh, uh, my big bag first we got my bats we got uh, I got a bat weight on it just because always gotta have a bat weight, I love bat weights. It's a Louisville Slugger, it's just a training bat. It's ash, it's like, I think it's like 35 inches, 46 ounces. I love swinging it before I touch a normal bat. It makes the bat feel like a feather. It works on bat speed. That shit, I just, I love it. Next we got uh, one of my wood bats. I use this more for like training just so I don't break my expensive wood bat. 
This is a, uh, it's called a 330 sticks. It's a company that my, um, my coach makes here locally in North Carolina. Um, I'm not sure if he's on the internet or not, but I love these things. It's rock maple. It's got a little bit of a cupped in and it's a 33, 31. It's uh, so he takes a, he takes like a normal bat that you break and he models it. And this is like a Evan Longoria model. It's uh, I 13. Love it. Next is I, I got my game wood bat. I use this in games and a little bit in practice. It's the Victus Tatis model. It's also a 33 inch, 31 ounce. It's got a bigger cupped end. I'm not a fan of cupped ends, but I love the way this swings and the color is awesome. That might be it. Nah, that might be over the scoreboard. That ball was Oh my god! <laughs> so close! Yeah, we're in between the fence and the scoreboard. That's either on it or it's over it. One more. Now for my metal bat that I have in my bag right now. I got a pretty old, I think it was from 2015. It's a Demarini Voodoo Overlord. I think I actually think they're pretty rare now. You can't really find them in that good of condition. It's a uh, 34, 31. To me, this is better than the goods. The like the the goods, like the voodoo's, like the newer voodoo's. I just think that this is a whole lot better. People just sleep on it. Oh! <laughs> Is that three today? That's three times. Flip deck. Uh, I'll get into my pitching stuff that I use for pitching because I also pitch. I just got a foam roller that I got, I think, from Ross actually. It was like 10 bucks. I love it. I use it to, oh, sorry. I use it to warm up before I throw, before I hit, get loose, get my hips loose, get my back loose. And if you've never had your back cracked on one of these, it's awesome. And I also got a bunch of bands. I got uh, your typical J bands. Pretty sure every baseball player knows what these are. Use them to warm up throwing. I love them. They, I feel like they've helped my arm a lot since being injured in middle school. And then I just got these little like exercise bands. I use these to stretch. I use this one for like my arms and my shoulders, get my rotator cuffs loose. And then I use this big black one for my legs before I start doing sprints or anything like that to get my legs loose, just so I can get the extra pull on my hammies and then I'll go to my hat on it my uh, my helmet that I have I have uh, uh, just a De Marini. I think it's called a paradox helmet it's just black I got a Evo shield chin guard on it because I don't want to get hit in the face and then I also got my school's logo my high school's logo I put it on the back because I'm gonna take this to college with me I just want to kind of represent my high school a little bit and that's pretty much it for my hat, helmet. And then I got my oven mitt. People have mixed opinions about these. Some people don't like them, some people do. I think it looks 
awesome in your back pocket whenever you're running. And it also helps, you know, protecting from someone stepping on your foot. I mean, your, uh, your hand. And then we got my Evo Shield Guards. I love these, I actually just got these not too long ago. This is the uh, extended one with the little like forearm. So it just goes like right here and then it attaches. It's like the one Acuna Jr. uses. I love Evo Shield. They're the best in my opinion. They've always been the best and they just keep coming up with new ideas. And this is my uh, shin guard. It's the uh, extended one, so the normal one. I had a black one that only went up to about right here. So this is like significantly bigger. And whenever you're seeing high velos, I tend to foul off a lot of my foot. So I just keep this in case. And yeah, I take one off the shin. And then I keep a football in my bag, a little football for before I throw. I like to use it sometimes whenever I'm throwing, just cause I feel like it, uh, it warms up my shoulder a little bit more because um, it, you know, it weighs more than a baseball. And a lot of uh, higher programs, a lot of college programs use them, especially for pitchers. I just like, you know, play around with it. I like to throw it a little bit before games. And then uh, I got my gloves, my babies in a rosin bag. This is, uh, this is one of my new custom 44 Pro gloves. I love 44. This is a uh, 574 model. It's 11 and three quarters. Yeah, I just, I've always used 44 since I was a sophomore is when I started using them. So about three years, I think it's gonna be my fourth year. They just, they have the best customized options. They're cheap, they're great leather for the price. This one says Connor Hill on it with uh, my college's logo. And uh, I got where I was born on the palm, the main logo, cause that's where I was born. And then it just says never quit. I really just use this one for pitching. And then uh, I got my everyday glove. This is the one I use at third or just playing catch with. It's uh, also a 44, the same model, 574, but it's got a iWeb. This one has my high school's logo on it, just in black and white. And then it also has where I was born with the North Carolina flag on it. And then uh, on the pinky, it says, remember your roots. Just, you know, remember where you came from. And then uh, this is also 11 three quarters. And then on the palm it says 29 because my mom and my dad's birth dates are combined or 29. It's my favorite number. And then this is the first basement I got, also a 44 with uh, my other school's logo of their actual like mascot. And then uh, I got the state flag. I got Benson, North Carolina, because that's where I pretty much grew up at. And uh, it says mom and dad with a heart right there. And this is a. Uh, 12 and three quarters. It's just their normal first basement, I guess. I love it. And then I will get into this side pocket. This is where I keep my uh, my liquid pine tar. Ooh. So this is like the, the gooey stuff with the uh, little shovel is what I call it. And then little rag bag. Make sure you're about all sticky. I should probably take it out of my bag because it's hot and it'll melt, but it's whatever. And then uh, in this little pocket, I have just my two sticks of normal pine tar. It's uh, Cypress, I think is how you pronounce it. I got one for cold weather because it gets really cold here in North Carolina. And then I got uh, some super sticky. Just so, these are a whole lot easier to do than the liquid because you don't have to go through the mess and it dries a lot quicker, so. And then our last pocket, kind of got a bunch of stuff in here. I got a black Under Armour arm sleeve, two white ones. I love wearing the white ones. I only really wear the black ones whenever I pitch just because you're not really allowed to. And then I got one, two, I think I got another one here somewhere. I got four things of like the, the stretchy tape. I think it's called like Power Flex. I love this for my wrist or, you know, if you twist an ankle or something, I like putting it on this just cause you can make it as tight as you want. And it's better for whenever you're sweating. And then I just got normal athletic tape. And then my keys. 
And then uh, my batting gloves. I just got these work gloves. They're called Hydro Hide, I guess. I just got them for Lowe's for like 15 bucks. I love taking batting practice with them because they don't rip as easy. And uh, they're a whole lot like thicker on your hands, so they prevent blisters a whole lot better. And then I got a white pair of, uh, I'm pretty sure these are the, uh, one of the newer Bryce Harper models. They're white. I really only wear white batting gloves in games just because all white accessories are awesome. And uh, yeah, Under Armour batting, I, under, I love everything Under Armour as you can tell. And then my last, my last pair of batting gloves I got are these Under Armour Bryce Harper ones, I believe. These are like an older model. Yeah, they're black. These have been through a little bit more of a beating just because I like to use these in batting practice whenever the thick ones aren't really feeling too good. And then uh, the last thing I got is a uh, Thumb Pro. So it's kind of like a, it's kind of like a pro hitter, but it's a whole lot better. So it goes on your thumb whenever you hit like this. I love it because it really helps with like miss hits. You take one off the end of the bat and it like stings. It doesn't sting as bad. And it also helps increase bat speed. And um, I got mine in orange because my college is orange and it's super bright so it stands out a whole lot better. And uh, I've been using these for about, for about four or five months now. And uh, my, actually the first time I've ever used this in a game, I actually hit a home run in, a, uh, in like a conference title game. Ever since then, I really haven't took it off my thumb. And uh, now that NCAA athletes are allowed to be sponsored, I, uh, I've actually got a partnership with them. And uh, you can use my code, Connor Hill, all caps, at checkout, and you get 10% off. And they just, these things are awesome. Once you, once you try one, you will never go back.